hi guys good morning you're welcome to my youtube channel if you're new here please subscribe like and um, comment on my youtube channel please put on your notification button so that anytime i upload a video you'll be notified thank you guys thank you for always watching so guys today we will be talking about the spiritual and health benefits of alligator pepper you know some people don't know the benefits and the uh, spiritual aspects of alligator pepper alligator pepper is a very is a very strong seed it heals a lot of things and it even stops witchcraft. With alligator pepper, you can overcome so many things. Even from the evil people, evil friends, anywhere. Some people don't know the benefits of alligator pepper. And some people don't know what is alligator pepper. But you are an Igbo and you don't know what is alligator pepper. In Igbo land, you use alligator pepper to meet and greet like use it with the uh, cola nuts like our elders they use it with cola they eat it with cola nuts if they're in a meeting or anywhere and this alligator pepper it does a lot of things number one it cures spiritual and uh, spiritual sickness and disease Number two, you can make you can use alligator pepper to make a a favor prayer. You understand? Prayers for favor. If you need a favor from God, you can use alligator pepper to make your prayers. When my mom came for Omogo. He was uh, sorry. She was persuading my husband to be using alligator pepper. She was persuading him to buy it, put it in your pocket, put it in your shop, keep it anywhere you're going, put it in your car. Alligator pepper chases away uh, witchcraft. Yes, it does, and it's very very effective. And when my husband started using it. He confirmed it and now my husband doesn't go anywhere without alligator pepper when you want to use alligator pepper for prayers of uh, prayers for favor uh, you can use it like when you bring your alligator pepper you bring out seven seeds from it that seven seeds you pray Maybe by 12 in the night or by 1 in the night, 1 a.m. or 12, you pray with the alligator pepper. Then chew it. As you are chewing the alligator pepper, you'll be saying your prayers. Whatever you want, whatever you want uh, to happen in your life, any good thing that you want to happen in your life at that moment, while you are chewing the alligator pepper, be saying your prayers and after saying your prayers you swallow it and when you want to make prayers for negativity maybe anything that you don't want in your life bring the alligator pepper seed seven seeds of them chew it and be saying your prayers saying those things that you don't want all those bad energy, negativity in your life, bad dreams, anything that you don't want. After saying the prayers and chewing it, you spit it out. Don't swallow it. And you see from that day. Yes, you will see how everything will start going on in your life. You can use it to bless or curse someone. You can use alligator pepper to cause anybody, maybe that wronged you. But not so. 
You cannot use alligator pepper for evil purpose. You cannot use alligator pepper for evil purpose because it will not work. It symbolizes favor. Good thing. Alligator pepper is not for evil purposes. Cannot use it to hurt someone. Cannot use it to take what is not belong what does not belong to you. Alligator pepper is used for favor. Is used for good thing. Is used for prosperity. Then you can use alligator pepper to protect yourself. When you're going to the village, or maybe you're going to a place that you know that maybe some people that will be coming there, they are not good people. And you want to protect yourself. Just take the alligator pepper and put it inside your pocket. And go wherever you want to go. Wherever you are drinking, with friends, relatives, family, and you don't trust some persons there, put alligator pepper in your mouth and be drinking. Whatever, whatever they are doing there will not get to you. You use it to chase away bad dreams. I've said it here. You chew it, you say whatever you want to say. And you spit it out. Then you sprinkle it in your house. Then maybe you are noticing that witchcraft is disturbing you in your house. At your doorsteps, sprinkle the alligator pepper. Or maybe that's the, the way it used to come. Don't You don't open it. You can hang it somewhere at your doorstep. Witchcraft will not visit you again from that night. That is the benefit, spiritual benefit of alligator pepper. You can use it to detect poison. Maybe where you go, they, they buried a poison there. Or maybe something is not right at that environment. It can detect your body. You will not feel comfortable anymore because you are with alligator pepper, and you'll be pushed to go out from that place. Alligator pepper is very necessary. If you are an Igbo man or Igbo woman and you don't use and you don't know any, you don't know alligator pepper and you, you've not been using it, my sister, my brother, you are lacking. You are lacking behind. Alligator pepper is very, very necessary. Whether you are a Christian or, or a pagan, it doesn't matter. It's a natural something. So, use it and if you start using it from today you will thank me later if you want to pray for favor chew it seven chew it say whatever you want and swallow it and if you want for negativity chew it say whatever bad thing you don't want in your life spit it out and if you are going out, you can take seven alligator pepper and, like, how will I say it? Just use it to, like, socha hoge. I don't know how I'm going to speak it in English. Just use it and, like, spiritual, you remove something, like you are removing something from your body. Use it on your body, all over your body. Then you fling it away. Alligator pepper is very good for us. Oh. And health benefit of it. It boosts immune system. If your immune system is down, I eat alligator pepper like tomorrow no day. It boosts immune system. 
I chew it every day. And it's helping me. It also heals menstrual cramps. If you are the type of person that eats alligator pepper every time, you will not be having menstrual cramps. Like it will reduce it. In digestion, it boosts energy too. It gives you energy. It boosts our uh, the spam. Men, eat alligator pepper. It boosts your spam. Like you're having watery spam every time, or maybe uh, you notice that your spam is not the way it used to be. Eat alligator pepper always. All these natural things that we don't know, many natural things that we don't know that it's it it has benefits both spiritual all these natural grasses that we are seeing inside the bush all of them have their own spiritual benefits and their health benefits too i remember when i was growing up when i was staying with my grandmother she would always enter inside the bush bring some grasses that we even play with, we don't even know that is beneficial. She will cook all of them for malaria drug. We'll be taking it. And you see, malaria and typhoid will run very far from us. Alligator pepper still chases away malaria. You can do your research on it. It does a lot of things. And while you are doing all these things, you do it with faith. Both spiritual and health benefits. While you are doing it, you pray and you do it with faith. Because when you want to do anything in this life and you come up with negativity, it will not work. Whatever you are doing, believe, be positive that this thing will work for you yes and it will work for the fact that negativity have crossed through your mind it will not work i don't believe in negativity i believe that whatever i do even if it doesn't work out i don't call it negativity i call it positivity because you don't know why it did not work out. So if you are using alligator pepper, use it with faith. All these things I've said, in Igbo land, an elder will still tell you the same thing. An elder that knows. Use alligator pepper and you will thank me later. So if you have any question, Go to my comment section. I will be there to answer you. Thank you. And please subscribe to my YouTube channel. I have a lot of things to teach you guys. Watch and like. Invite your friends to subscribe. Thank you and God bless you. Bye-bye.